We went on a trip and we want to know exactly how far did we go. Given our speed and the time that passed by, all we have to do is multiply. I like going on trips in my yellow speedboat. If I travel at 48 kilometers per hour for 10 hours, how far do I go? I'll give you a hint. If you're stuck, you can use the formula. The distance I travel equals the length of time I spend traveling multiplied by my speed. If Yellow travels at 48 kilometers per hour, in one hour he covers a distance of 48 kilometers. But then he travels another hour, so we have to add another 48 kilometers. Then another hour and another 48 kilometers. We have to repeat this process 10 times because that's the number of hours he spends traveling. We end up with 10 groups of 48. We could use repeated addition to add them up. But a quicker way is to solve the equivalent multiplication problem. 10 times 48. Let's do it. Draw a box. Divide it into two columns because the first number, 10, has two digits. Divide it into two rows because the second number, 48, also has two digits. Now, Draw a diagonal line through each of the smaller boxes. Write 10 along the top of the box and 48 down the right hand side of the box. Next, multiply and fill in the blanks. 0 times 4 is 0. So write a 0 above and below the diagonal. Again, 0 times 8 is 0. 1 times 4 is 4. This time, write 0 above the diagonal and 4 below. 1 times 8 is 8. Next, add up the numbers along the diagonals. 0 0 plus 0 plus 8 is 8. 0 plus 4 plus 0 is 4. And 0. Now read off the answer, crossing off the first 0. 4, 8, 0. So if yellow travels at 48 kilometers an hour for 10 hours, he covers a total distance of 480 kilometers. That's almost the distance between Albury and Echuca on the Murray River. Now that's quite a trip, isn't it? <laughs>